So after ages, I'm back and so has the Duel Monsters World event, Duelist Kingdom. Let's do this. It's time to do 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 it's been real long time since we had a Duel Monsters World event, besides the Duke Devlin Unlock. I mean before the Duke, last one I remember was Odin Roaming which was ages ago. So anyway let's look at this event, that is it good or not. I have played few duels on my other account personally and from my experience it's kinda good. You select your area, you get bonus attack for using your area's attribute, which is also gets decided whether the area is being used a lot or not. What do I mean by that? Well, let's look for today. Most used areas are light attribute and dark attribute area, ruins and cave. That areas get the least amount of bonus which is only 100 attack. Least used areas are fire and water which is sea and volcano which will give you 600 attack bonus. That's pretty good. And note that this is a PvP event and each player selects areas for themselves and they duel each other. You can pick from 6 different different areas. Also the areas between the most used and least used gets the 300 bonus which is wind and earth for now. These bonuses might change every day cause according to what they say they are being updated every day in order to most used to least used. I don't know how they decided for first day though. So dueling will be pretty much how it was on the ladder but everyone gets a bonus attack and after you get 100 star chips you can duel pegasus which will on result it will give you treasure boxes which will give you the event rewards which you can see from right here. Summoner card is kinda good, lets you special summon a monster from your hand with the same level as this monster which is level 2 so you can make a rank 2 XCs or you can summon a tuner and make a level 4 synchro, that's what they say right here. All out attacks, if a monster gets special summoned while you have this card on the field, you can change it to face up attack position. Also during that turn that monster must attack if able which will be, so you can force your opponent to attack yourself or maybe you can use this card along with sub terriers. you summon them face down, you flip them up, you activate their attacks, we might try that. Also don't be afraid of picking hard when you are going to duel against Pegasus by the way, it's so easy anyway, PvE duels are pretty easy on this event, like how it was. You get 50 star chips for winning in PvP and 25 for losing, unless you surrender of course. Also legendary duelists appear sometimes in Duel Monsters Duel world, which is again easy to win against, it gives you exactly 100 star chips if you win, so you can duel against Pegasus immediately. This event's attribute thing kinda reminds me of Leo and Luna's duel carnival, but in that event, bonus attack is based on their attributes and everyone had to use that attribute. So for this event, like blue eyes for light, harpies for wind, shirinami for fire and so on, I know event isn't like super good or something, but at least we got a duel monsters event after ages which is a pvp one so it's not that boring to play also another good thing is you can get 50 gems for each day if you duel three times and for the fourth time you get x jewels for events to use them on the trader axe which reminds kc cups event gifts also the tdgp for 5 this world so that's it i'll come up with different decks and duels for this event in few days stay tuned for that so until then thanks for watching and see you soon.